Here's how to turn off voicemail on your iPhone. Now, if you have an iPhone, maybe you're traveling overseas or you just prefer a voicemail to be turned off so you don't get any voice messages, I'll walk you through the entire process. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, we're going to walk through a few different options. The first one is to head into your settings. And we'll scroll to the very bottom in iOS 18. They ch change this and moved it around a bit. But let's tap on apps here. We're navigating to your phone. So scroll down till we get to P here. Tap on phone. Now we're going to check and turn off two things here. One is we're going to go to call forwarding. And we're going to make sure call forwarding is turned off. Essentially, if call forwarding is on and it's forwarding to another device, then that other device can pick up that voicemail and essentially deactivating on this phone doesn't do anything. So make sure that's toggled off. And then we'll scroll down here and you can see live voicemail. You want this as well to be toggled off because essentially you don't want that live voicemail to be enabled when someone calls. You just don't want any voicemail at all. So turn off both of those. Now, the next thing we'll do is head into the notes here and there's a little code voicemail deactivation code. And the code that you're gonna type in is pound 004 pound. So let's open up the phone app here, go to the keypad and type in pound 004 pound and then hit call. And what you'll see is setting deactivation succeeded for all of these things, voice call forwarding, data call forwarding, fax call forwarding, all of these different things. And basically when you get a voicemail or when you get a call and it switches to a voicemail, that is forwarding it to your voicemail services. And by disabling all call forwarding to the voicemail, you're turning off or disabling that voicemail. So just hit dismiss here. Now that's everything you can do on your phone, but there's one extra step that you can go through to disable it at the carrier side so it never even gets to your phone. So to do that, let's open up a web browser and we're just gonna type in turn off voicemail and your carrier. So I have an AT&T carrier. So basically I can type in turn off voicemail on AT&T. And I can just scroll down and it says to turn off your voicemail, you're just gonna log in, go to your plans and your phone, go to your preferences and toggle off voicemail. So essentially this with the carrier will disable the ability to leave voicemails. You won't need to worry about it again if you're traveling out of the country or you don't want voicemails, you're busy, you don't basically want any kind of voicemails. Maybe you're being barraged by a bunch of voicemails and it's full, you can always turn it off and then down the road, you can turn it back on if you feel like doing that. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.